What's up, nerds? Lauren here from nerdcaliber.com, and I'm at Otacon 2015, where I ran into Rogue from the X-Men. How are you enjoying the convention? I'm really loving it. It's the third day, and I'm really excited. I finally get to wear my Rogue costume, so life is good. Well, you look amazing. Can you tell me a little bit about your cosplay? What inspired you to cosplay as Rogue? Well, Rogue has always been my favorite X-Men. She's spunky, she's happy, she's got that southern accent, which I don't have, but it's all good. She's just a happy person, even though she can't touch people. She's got a sunny disposition. <laughs> and she can fly. <laughs> True. <laughs> can you tell me, like, how did you put your cosplay together? Okay, so sometimes I, I make my costumes, sometimes I buy them used, and sometimes I commission them. I do not know how to work with spandex. I don't have the time to learn right now, so I commissioned it. And I absolutely love it. Couldn't couldn't have a better things to say about my, my commissioner. Is, is there anything that's difficult to wear about the cosplay? You know, actually, this is one of my more comfortable costumes. I always thought wearing spandex, I'd have to lose like 20 pounds before I did it. I said, you know what? I'm tired of that. I'm just going to wear it. I would say the boots, they keep falling down and I have to pull them up. Gotcha. But um, usually people are really patient with me if I need to pull them up before they want to take a picture. Great. Now, why did you choose to go with this version of Rogue? There have been countless out there, but you chose a really classy version. Well, that's an easy one. 90s Rogue is best Rogue. <laughs> she, like I said, she has a sunny disposition. She's not mopey like in the movies. Oh, I can't touch people. So uh, that's a little negative, but that's how I feel. I like the hair. It's absolutely giant. I have big hair, too. So I, I really enjoyed that. My name is Lauren. This is Rogue. We're here at Otacon 2015 with NerdCaliber.com. We'll see y'all later.